So I obviously love sea turtles and I've got so many favorites, but one would definitely be Yoshi, the world famous traveling sea turtle. I call her a goat, greatest of all times, um, purely because she's a world record holder. It's never before recorded that a loggerhead sea turtle traveled from Africa to Australia. But what was also really special is how the Australians received her with like open arms. They were thrilled. They adopted her immediately. So we we tracked her for three years and she traveled 40,000 kilometers. And I think if you think about that distance, you realize how big the ocean is and how incredible sea turtles are and how many risks they face out in the ocean. And that's why ocean conservation is so important. Sea turtles are these amazing navigators and they the perfect reason why it's so important to focus on transboundary conservation efforts because they travel the world. So if the nesting sites weren't protected in Mozambique, we wouldn't see any loggerheads or leatherbacks traveling along the African coastline or as we've seen with our release turtles around the entire world. The sea turtle conservation projects in southern Africa have had a huge impact on this critically endangered species. Preparing sea turtles for release means there is not only an increase in nesting females, but also an increase in hatchlings, which indicates a growing sea turtle population overall in the ocean. Over the last decade, hundreds of sea turtles have been rescued by Two Oceans Aquarium Education Foundation, rehabilitated and released a huge contribution to sea turtle conservation globally. Ultimately, we're protecting one ocean. We are connected by the ocean. So it's wonderful to see the Peace Park Foundation work in establishing more transboundary and transfrontier parks.